What is up, everybody? It's your boy, Chris Cage, coming at you two times. And it's time now for Hot Wheels All Out. Whoa, what is that section over there missing? Well, I'm pretty sure you could tell that we are near the end of the realistics and fantasy hullabaloo type stuff. Um, as with all Hot Wheels All Out races, they're sponsored by the Sunflower Company. The only small business gift shop that's run and owned by my bestie. It's that where you'll be able to find sunflower theme items and non sunflower theme items. We are in block G, which can explain why everything over there is missing. I had to move everything over to my filming station so that I'll have to get up and then be like, oh, I gotta move this, I gotta move this, I gotta move this. So they're all over here right by me. So that it'll be an easier transition. So if you notice, basically during Hot Wheels All Out filming, there were a couple of Easter eggs. Basically, like anytime you see a section missing, uh, basically it's me filming a section or filming certain cars and whatnot. And now I'm on to the way far left where blocks G through L are at. So we're getting there. Plus, also, a uh, big shout out to everybody who is uh, watching live on this premiere uh, version of Hot Wheels All Out. You can live comment in that little gimmick that says live chat, and you can say whatever you want, whether it's good, bad, in between, or you just want to be silly. Please be respectful as well. Just thought I'd point that out. If I didn't point that out earlier, please do that. And, uh, yeah, that's all there is to it. So it's time now to get started with round number one of Hot Wheels All Out, Fantasy Cars in Block G. It's round number one, and you know what that means. It's time for those famous words from our Hot Wheels finish line. Oops. Hot Wheels Racers, take your lane! And to that one guy who was sitting there saying, what is a large charge of going to race? Well, here you go. Here is one racing. Let's hope if it'll win in this first heat. Winner, lane three. I promise you there will be more large charge cars coming along. So this ain't the only one we got. Your winner is Bubblematic. Everyone find, found themselves just bunching up right over here. Your winner is the Vanster in lane five. Winner, lane two. We're going to lane two for your winner, and it is Audacious with the FTE wheels. Your winner in lane two is the High Rakers version of Montezuma as he scoots on away from the shot. The winner in lane five is No Fear Race Car. Going to lane four, and your winner is the governor. Winner, lane six. Your winner in lane six is Fast Fish. Winner, lane five. We're going to lane five with your winner, and it is Shredster. He just took off like a rocket, just like that. Winner, representing the Flash, is Synchro. And he's going, going, and stopping. Winner, lane three. This McDonald's car that I'm going to have to try to get the name pretty soon here has won. Unless some of y'all know what this car is called, let me know in the comments what this is called, by the way. Drop it in a hashtag, or... Or, or no, drop the hashtag in the comments. Random selection, 
two MR11s in this heat. And the one on the left in lane one has gotten the win. There you see it. MR11 in lane one wins. Your winner in lane three is Bedlam in the Burbs, aka Bedlam. Speed Blaster beats out a FTE version of Hammerhead to get the win. Your winner in lane three is Repo Duty. We're going to lane four for your winner here, and it is another Speed Blaster. Your winner in lane two is RD3. We're going to lane five with your winner, and he looks like he skipped into lane six just, just because. Your winner is Loop Coop. Your winner in lane one is Rescue Duty. Your winner in lane five goes to this bright green Ultra Rage. Winner in lane three is um, Prototype H24. The winner in lane three is Blitzbeater. This car got thrown off the track here, but your winner is in lane five, and it is Amazon. Your winner in lane two is RD8. Your winner in lane one is Drift King. It was a Drift King that won in the last Fantasy Car Race. Winner, lane three. Your winner in lane three is Solar Reflex. Winner, lane three. Your winner in lane three is 24-7. And yes, I know it looks bad, but this is the best yellow version I got with this design on it. I only have one of these, by the way, in my whole collection. Silhouette gets the win. We're going to lane four for your winner, and I think it's Evil Weevil. So nice, so evil, in the words of Dan Housen. Winner, lane one. Your winner in lane one, all the way over here, is Ballistic in this all green color. The winner is in lane five, and it is Turbo Rooster. Your winner in lane four, by no surprise, is Symbolic. Your winner in lane two is Split in Image Two.
The winner in lane one is Boulevard Bruiser, Race Team Edition. Your winner in lane two. I have no idea who won it. I think it might just, or I think it might go to um, Great Gas Speed. That's what I'm thinking. By the way, any time, or by the way, if you point out an error, I do a Hot Wheels All Out rematch via a versus video with another car. So yeah. Winner, lane four. Your winner in lane four is a uh, baseline okay so we have an interesting random selection these are both ice cream trucks despite them both saying quick bite this is the older one this is the newer one so this is a double random selection drop that in the hashtag or or no drop that in the comment section i meant hashtag double random selection let's race And after all of that discussion, a winner has emerged, and it's a Zamac version of D Muscle. Winner, lane one. Your winner in lane one is a Fire Eater. We're going to lane five for your winner, and it is the Gazella GT. Winner, lane one. Your winner in lane one is, um, what is it? Roll Cage. We're going to lane one for your winner, and it is High Tech Missile. Winner, lane two. The winner in lane two is the retooled version of Ballistic. Drop it in the hashtag random selection. Two paradoxes racing side by side. And none of them winning. Winner, As your winner in lane three is this color shifters version of Power Rocket. Your winner in lane five is this two timer. Your winner in lane five is Speedosaurus. Winner, lane one. We have yet another symbolic moving on today. Winner, lane one. Your winner in lane one is High Voltage. Your winner in lane one is Dirty Outlaw. Second to the last race. Winner, lane six. Bulletproof in lane six gets the win. And we have our final three. Time to see who'll move on to the next round. And just like that, round one is finished. Here is your winner, and that was retroactive. As we see, all the cars that have moved on from round, or moved off from round one. Look at that car right there. A lot of good ones, two speed blasters in this one. A number of accelerators in there. Silhouette is in there. A lot of nice ones. My Boulevard Bruiser, symbolic. It's gonna be a shocker of a 
of a second round in the other round as well, too. And as you see right there, 49 cars moved on. Uh, round one is in the books. Round two starts right now. Round number two, everybody. Here's your first matchup. And your winner in lane two is RD8. Your winner in lane five is Amazon. Your winner is Baseline. Why are you running away? Oh, random selection here. Two symbolics in this race. Let's race. Speaking of symbolic, hit one. A lot of shockers here, and your winner in lane two is Prototype H24. Winner, lane three. The winner in lane three, damn, he brutalized uh, Speed Blaster there with that win. It is uh, Boulevard, Blue, Boulevard Bruiser Racing Edition. Your winner in lane three is high voltage. Second to the last race. Winner, lane two. Your winner in lane two this time is split in image two. And finally we have this high tech missile. He has to stay upright in order to move on to the finals. And he does just like that. He didn't even flinch off the track at all. Which is amazing. And with that out of the way, look at this. From 49 down to 9. We 40 cars have been eliminated and now 8 others will do so in the finals. And the finals will be coming up right about now. All right, finals. Here's your first of two heats. Time to determine the two contenders in the gauntlet. Winner, lane one. Symbolic ain't gonna move on. Amazon ain't gonna move on. Boulevard Bruiser ain't gonna move on. Prototype H24. All got decimated by this acceleracer, RD8. Now it's time to see which one of these three is going to compete against uh, RD8 in the gauntlet. Winner, lane one. Well, we are guaranteed to have an acceleracer win Hot Wheels All Out with high voltage winning. But what team will it come out of? Will it come out of Taeku or Racing Drones? High voltage representing Teku is taking on RD8, representing Racing Drones. Hence, RD stands for Racing Drone. This interesting gauntlet race featuring two acceleracers is going to happen right now. Let's get them on the track. All right, it's gauntlet time. RD8, high voltage. Who will win? It will be RD8 picking up the first win. He has to win one more to win the whole thing. And ladies and gentlemen, high voltage forces the split. Now I gotta put them together side by side for some close corners racing. Winner, lane three. RD8 got the best of it in lane three. Now it's time to switch him around. Winner, lane four. 
and just like that, we have ourselves a winner. And your winner of Hot Wheels All Out Fantasy Cars Block G is... Ladies and gentlemen, it's RD8. I don't know. I'm going to have to check my little All Out winners bin. But I think this is our first ever Accelerators winning for Hot Wheels All Out this year. I'm pretty sure it has been done before. Or I'm pretty sure a Accelerator has won before, which they, which they probably had many other years before. But for this year, RD8 is the first Accelerator to win Hot Wheels All Out for 2021. So congratulations to RD8 on that massive victory. And that will do it for today's Hot Wheels All Out race. Next time we see you, we'll be racing real cars in the same block as well. So stay tuned for that. And that'll, be, that'll do it, everybody. I hope you like this video. Give it a thumbs up. Comment down below. If you are brand new watching this, be sure you subscribe. And also, turn on the notifications bell as well. It's your boy, Chris Cage. I'm coming at you two times, and we will see you at the next race.